The Apex Predator has arrived. One of the all-time greats has seen and done everything there is to do in this business. The following contest is a tag team tables match. Introducing first, representing RK Bro from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds. The Viper. Legend killer, now possibly the greatest legend in WWE history. Welcome to the USO Penitentiary! And representing the Bloodline from San Francisco, California, weighing in at 251 pounds, one half of the Raw Tag Team Champions, Jimmy Uso! Jimmy and Jay Uso have single-handedly transformed the tag be the team division. And if you ask him, what made the difference? difference? What made you guys step up in your game? Patient. Jimmy and Jay would tell you, it was the moment we decided, we decided to, to stop being what other people that I think is amazing. amazing. And to start my day being when the play who we are. Shows were a thousand faces, hey! Oh. Give me that crown, get in my way, you to be put down. It ain't your place, so this my town. If I want that shit, then I'll get it right now. I'm losing it, the noose if it's some loose shit, a stupid myth. You choose to live or choose to dip, you choose to fight or lose your grip and lose your gift. Oh. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Is everybody in the world? Hey, Jimmy's been helping him run things in the bloodline. Gentlemen, we are about to see a wrestling clinic. Here comes Brutus Creed. And representing the Creed Brothers from Lexington, Ohio, weighing in at 285 pounds, one half of the NXT Tag Team Champions, Brutus Creed. Few men in WWE can match this guy when it comes to pure wrestling. Except maybe his brother. I am looking forward to seeing what this kid can do in the ring. An extremely bright future for Brutus Creed. Here comes a reckoning. The Archer of Infamy, ready to pass judgment. Judgment Day from New York, New York, weighing in at 249 pounds, Damian Priest. Priest has truly embraced his deepest, darkest side, and I couldn't be happier. We've seen Priest and the rest of Judgment Day destroy families, put competitors in the hospital. What, just to get ahead? For Priest, the ends justify the means. A look of pure disdain on the face of Damian Priest. Well, it's because he has passed judgment on the entire WWE Universe and has found them all 
unworthy. We're about to see someone plan it through the pine. It's a table match with Thornton and Jimmy Uso. And on the other side of the ring, they are facing off with Brutus Creed and Damian Priest. There are few things more satisfying in the WWE Universe than hearing a table break, especially when it was a match. Terry down the leg now. Damian veering his attention away from the match. Not the best idea. And that was an effective attack, guys. And now he's giving you all another chance to simply take it all in. Incoming! He leaves the ring and there's no countouts in this one. And what a maneuver we just saw there. What are we going to see here? Hung up on a second row. Hoist it up. Nice suplex. Vertical suplex. Corey, what is the approach in a match like this that is so singularly focused on a specific end result? Oh, there's no secret in this one. Every bit of offense is done with the goal of putting your opponent through a table. Create as much chaos as Look at that gash on the face of Brutus. Orton measuring. Turning to the ring now. Ooh, knee drop connects. Scary pattern starting to form as that upper area takes more damage. Classic Orton. Orton measuring. Boom! Surveying the scene. Drop in the knee. German suplex. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Dropped him with a big shoulder tackle. He gets back into the ring. On the apron. And it back the display of offense we just witnessed there. Now he's been put on the defensive. Great strength being shown here. Slips on the back door. Oh, a strong impact. Oh, a stiff punch. Just mounted with punches. And not, oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. What's he open to find down there? Oh, impact to the stomach. What a counter by Brutus. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. What they say, nothing good ever comes from getting the tables. And he's been concentrated on that area throughout this one. He knows every blow there weakens his opposition more each time. Side of the ring now. What's the plan here? And Eric's offense with a powerful purpose. Face first with a waistlock takedown. Textbook fireman's carry takeover. No, oh, God, what a shot to the face. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Oh, impressive counter. Whatever you can do, I can do better. Counters on top of counters. He's setting his team on the guy. Son's about to have a really bad night. He's crashing down. He's back into the ring. Punishing stretch. They have 
try their hardest to avoid damage. But I think the table might... Himself continuing his work, and it's the pain too much. And he's endeavored so much thus far, I guarantee he won't quit right now. He's got a plan for that table, and it does not involve a dinner party. Solid contact from the Viper. Priest has his opponent up. Splinters out for weeks. For my money, these two just might be the best tag team on the roster today.